Jake Mintz here, Jordan Schusterman, Cespedes Family Barbecue. And Jordan, we have a special guest. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Uh, recently signed with the St. Louis Cardinals. Congratulations. It is Miles Michaelis. Miles, welcome. Welcome to the couch. Welcome, welcome to the Wear Meetings. Awesome. Thank you. Glad to be here with you guys. So you just signed with the Cardinals, but there's a, another animal that you're potentially <laughs> more well-known for. What yeah. is your nickname that uh, you were called? They call me the Lizard King. They call they. you the Lizard King. And, yeah. and who is they? Everyone. All your friends, all your family. Uh, yeah, everybody. That's, you know, video got on YouTube and it mm -hmm. stuck and, you know, so, I've been the okay, Lizard so King what, what are we talking about? Let's give a little, yeah, let's give, give a little give backstory. Some, give some Why context. do they call you the Lizard King? Uh, I was uh, playing out in the Arizona Fall League. Of course. And, you know, that's a long season. You, you know, you play your regular season and then you get out of the Fall League and it's even longer. Uh, we're sitting in the bullpen. You know, guys are getting bored and there's little <laughs> desert lizards running around and I'm from Florida. We got a lot of lizards of in my backyard, so I snatch one, you know, cat-like, and we start going around like, who's going to eat this lizard? And it, it, it circles around back to me, and I wasn't going to back down from the challenge. Mm -hmm. So, uh, you know. So you ate the lizard. I ate the lizard, yeah. Now, have you ever, had you ever eaten a lizard before? Was that your first lizard? That was the first one, yes. First lizard. And the, the last one, or have you continued... To uh, uh, kind of, just I almost ate one in spring training the next year with the Padres, but the team doctor nixed it at the last. Oh, second. The doctor, the team doctor, doctor. Oh, that's yeah, great. yeah, Man, that's tough. team doctor. So, I've been meaning to thank him, so thank you, that, <laughs> team doctor, that, for the Padres. That is, I'm curious how quickly the nickname stuck because we, we get it, it's clear what it's referring to. Yeah. But was it like the next day, everyone in the Arizona Fall League is like, "That's the Lizard, that's King. The Lizard King." No, I don't think it really. I mean, you know. The intention was for the video to go viral, but okay. it, it didn't. Uh, maybe it is now. All right. But I think it was like until I signed with the Rangers, really, is that when people started to really oh, like hype it yeah. up. Because you go to a new place, and they, you, they Google you, and then the first thing they see is this video. Yeah. Okay. So that's when I think when it kind of took off. On a scale of like Jello to like tortilla chips, how crunchy was the lizard? Uh, it was crunchy. It was actually like well, it was crunchy, <laughs> and you know it's kind of soft because it's a lizard. So right. it was almost like tortilla chips in Jello. Oh, okay. So there which was a lot is, of texture going on there. Got which it. It's very really, unique. Yeah, really some combination. So yeah. th another thing I'm curious about the nickname is, as I mean, you've played a lot of professional baseball here and in Japan. Of course, I assume no one in Japan recognized you as the Lizard King. Would correct me if I'm or, wrong. Or did but your it, reputation <laughs> precede you across the Pacific? <laughs> uh, they kind of latched onto it for a second, yeah. but then once the season started, they kind of. You know, I asked them to bypass that. Right. Oh, that's, you were just that's miles. Yeah. Yeah. You're you just, were just miles. Miles, not the lizard guy. Is yeah. that the weirdest <laughs> thing you've ever eaten? Yes. Okay. That's that's probably yeah, by good. far by far the weirdest thing. Oh uh, well, in, I guess the weirdest for me, um, I ate some odd things in Japan. You yeah. know, the abalone and like parts of the fish right. and the crab that you wouldn't normally see on a menu here. Right. Sure. Makes but sense. but that stuff was all delicious. So. Yeah. I think at some point this upcoming season mm -hmm. we should sit down. With Miles, and we'll we'll make lizard. Oh, we'll sure. We'll cook up some sure. lizards. We'll come to St. Louis. Yeah. We'll fire up the grill. And yeah. We'll, why not? We'll get some lizards on there. I know. Uh, I heard iguana is really good. Really? Yeah. I, I know. Mean, in some parts of the Caribbean, they eat the the iguana. Let's get reptilian. I heard you can eat them. They're pretty good. Actually, the... preparing it instead of picking it up yeah. off the bullpen. Bullpen yeah. ground. Who's yeah. the guy on the Food Network that goes and eats all the weird foods? We, oh, we can uh, get him um, in with it. Uh, Bourdain. Bourdain. Yeah. Doesn't Bourdain do that. Yeah. Bourdain can come. He can show us how to grill the iguana. and We'll set it up. And we'll go. We'll set up. That seems yes. fun. I, I guess it sounds delicious. I don't know. Yeah. Well, Miles, thank you for joining yes. us. No, uh, thanks for having congratulations me. Congratulations on the contract. Congratulations on the nickname. Maybe you will, you will uh, uh, eat uh, lizards with you again. Yeah. 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 Maybe. Well, for, for, for the first, for the first time. time. For the first time. For the first time. Exactly. For the first okay. time for us. I'm Jake Mintz. This is Jordan Schusterman. This is the Lizard King. There he is. And we'll see you guys next There's time. There's only one of them. Thank you.